You know what time it is? Yes, I do. It's time, time to, to get, get cozy. cozy. All right, cozy gamers, welcome back to another episode of the Crooked Man. Today we are going to go through this door. And in this door is the computer room, right? I don't know. Check the sign. <laughs> Good idea. Space bar. Uh, oh. oh, computer room. I didn't even. Woo. Oh man, it was computer like what, a week since we last recorded. Yeah, something like oh, that. Yeah. Two weeks. All right. Oh look, there's something shiny in the garbage can for once. Last, it's overflowing. Well, where the fridge is the um, janitor, dude? A lot of complicated papers. I don't understand any of them. Well, maybe if you would have finished college. Really, you're not a nerd. <laughs> oh. Printed by Andrew Robinson, God. ID one four four two four six. All right, sounds good. Remember that. Wait, no, no, no. It probably wasn't that. Try. Because it's a four-digit number. Try that, 1709. Oh, 1709. All right, we'll remember that. You know what that sounds... Is that my fucking dogs? Well, they ran away. Who needs dogs? Why am I not allowed to take that paper? I don't know. 1709, oh. right? Yes. Oh, wait, no, computer. I'm at the... Com yeah, that. Don't look at it, David. You're going to have a freaking seizure. It's the gem scare. <clears throat> Friends, faculty... And stuff. I thank you for coming. Did you say today. and stuff or and, and staff? staff? Okay. And stuff. and stuff. You're too low to be considered <laughs> as people. You're just stuff. I thank you for coming today. We are glad to have a sunny graduation to start off the rest of our lives with royalty and money. The future may be uncertain for some, but the persistence we learned here will make us resolute. A round of applause for my fellow graduates. Oh wow, that's supposed to be like a, what do they call those people that, a standing ovation? This is supposed to be a student. I made them Overachievers? Like <laughs> the overachievers. <laughs> yeah, those guys. Okay, David, do what you want then on your own. What? The laptop? But there's no power. But even as valedictorians, well, or valedictorian, <laughs> valed, even as a valedictorian, there's something I can't help but lament. Lament, yep. It's about David Hoover. Fuck, did you do? What? Well, you as David? I don't. I can't recall. <laughs> what the fuck? What? He was. He was highly skilled, kind to us all, and admired by pupils and teachers alike. We all expected he would be proudly standing with us this morning to graduate, but he dropped out. <laughs> but our hopes were dashed Pretty much. by none other than the man himself, Bad David, hiding behind an innocent face. He's been fooling all his pupils and professors. No, so can't. Let me ask you all this. No. Boo. Should he be forgiven? Yes. Skin up. <laughs> can he escape punishment for betraying his friends and mentors? Hell yes. no. I mean, no. <laughs> Skip him! <laughs> I didn't think so. Let's get out the pitchforks and flame fire. He should forever be punished for what he has done to grant his selfish dreams. Man, we're playing as an asshole or something. I don't know. Stop it! Stop! Meow. What the fuck? You're the lowest of the low. Your dreams will never come true. What are you even good for? Sex. <laughs> Go off and die somewhere. Coward. I can't. I'm a coward. <laughs> so, haha, <laughs> joke's on you. Die, 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 die. What does he need to do with the die? We're gonna play some kind of Yahtzee? <laughs> I think we need dice. 
Okay, I was like, shit, stop yelling at me. <laughs> no, I was actually reading what he was saying. I think he broke the... Did he break the computer? I don't know what just happened, but it was stuck for there like a minute. No. I'm... I'm not a coward. I've been fighting a goddamn crooked man that keeps coming back. Damn it. I... I just... Oh, it's D. What was his voice? He was a dick. Yeah, he was a dick. Huh? I heard a scream. That was you? Jeez, you made me freak. <clears throat> that was not his voice. No, it wasn't. But it is now. What's the big idea, huh? Did something happen? Forget about it. Sorry for the surprise. It's nothing. There was a $2,000 computer, dude. But you okay? You're super pale. I don't go out in the sun. <laughs> I'm a vampire. <laughs> I'm just kind of tired. I came a long way, and I haven't slept. Bullshit! What were you doing in like the last episode? That's true. We were like in the nurse's station with a crooked man trying to kill us. Yeah. Sleeping. <sighs> Leave me alone. I can't be bothered to talk. Yeah, David, because you're fucking lying. We know you were sleeping. We see you. Hey, Amnius. <clears throat> huh? I already had a little, but it's an energy drink. Drink up. What? Seriously? Why does this? Why does this taste funny? <laughs> I don't need this. I told you. Leave me be. Drink it. Jeez. Oh, it's his odd taste to it, damn it. <laughs> you really look like you need food and drink. And I'm being nice. So accept my kindness. Alright, thanks. Tastes a little salty. But, what's all this from the guy who was calling me a shady punk? Mostly because you look like crap, dude. Come on. It's not like I'm heartless. I mean... I am trying to be a lawyer. Four dots. Besides, maybe it's fake. <laughs> Tell you what, I won't call you shit anymore. Now cheer up. You could be my client once I'm a lawyer. But you're still going to call me a punk. <laughs> you oh. said you wouldn't call me shady. <laughs> That's a quick turnaround. I'm grateful at any rate. Say, have you seen anyone else around here, particularly particularly a man around my age? A man? Nope. Nobody. He's who you're looking for. Yeah, though I don't really know how he looks. Tell me if you see him, okay? You got it. Doubt anybody be around here, though. Oh, but can I ask something, too? No. Professor Andrew, he always helped me out. His room on the third floor, but he, it's got a code, so I can't get in. I was thinking the professor might still have some lecture notes for me around or something. But yeah, tell me if you get it open, okay? 1709. All right, well, I, I do got... remember it. I was going to go over there and check it out <laughs> before we ended the episode. I'll wander around some more. Than... Oh, that's, that's you. me. Shut up. <laughs> Did you just see the D like, David, got it. <laughs> I'll wander around here some more then. You look like hell, so don't push yourself. I'll do what I want. <laughs> yeah, well, you be careful too. If you see any monsters, get away. Monsters? What the fuck are you talking about? But okay, yeah, sure. I've got a knife to defend myself anyhow. Can I have it? Smell ya. <laughs> Wasn't there a knife? At that hotel? Yeah, I don't I don't know if you kept it though. You'd have to check your inventory. <laughs> Maybe he's not as bad as I thought. Find out. Oh. Get an energy drink. So if you get your ass kicked, you can drink that. There we go. You might need it, you're a fifty percent health. <laughs> Fuck it. Oh, we don't have a knife. We have a cell phone. We have a lighter. And a hammer. And a, and hammer. a crowbar. Awesome. Boop.
Yeah, you're at 50% health. We'll rock it out. <coughs> um, third floor, he said? Third floor, yep. And it was... Oh. That's okay. what I'm thinking. 1709? 1709, but we gotta get to his room. I don't think it's over here, to be honest. No, yeah, it's, I didn't it's think so. to the far left. You know, these are vending machines. Why can't I just buy a drink here? Oh, oh they don't work. Well, they don't work, and I don't know if David really has much money on him. <coughs> Was it Robinson? Yep. Okay. He's the only Andrew here. All right. We'll go in, open the case. Hopefully, it's 1706. 09. 09? Good thing Jacob's here. Because I'd be like, oh, i got to go back down. But anyways, <laughs> we will continue in the next episode. So until next time, keep it cozy.